Radio check. Okay, hello? Okay, I should should be audible now. How horrendously loud is my aircon? Anybody? Uh, because, uh, where's my keyboard? 
not too loud at all. Okay, cool, cool. Because I'm sat right next to the aircon. It's not blowing on me. It's blowing the opposite direction to me. Um, instead, I have the warm as fuck pipe running right next to me. <laughs> but it's cooling the entire room down, so... It doesn't matter. Whew. Alright. It's just like loud ambient noise in the background. Yeah. But the, the way I have to have it, I have to point it away from me, so... But that's fine. Okay, cool. <sighs> yeah, yeah, it can't hear anything. Cool, cool, cool. Alright, good. That's, that's what I thought. I thought it should be fine. The pit lane speed limit is 60 kilometers per hour. Which is why I did it, <laughs> funnily enough. Your exit's clear. Don't cross the white line. Black flag will make to pit to serve this penalty. Well, anyway, hello. You've got three laps to serve this penalty. Clear left. It's out way too high up in the car, I feel like. He overshot, desperately trying to overtake me. Audio balance is spot on. Alright, cool, thank you. That's good. Ah. How wonderful. Uh, yeah, anyway, I'm planning on doing the four hours of Nürburgring solo. Um. So that's what I'm practicing for right now. And that's today. Like that's at that's at 2 p.m. It is currently almost 11 a.m. I'm going to do a naughty thing here. I'm going to drive all the way to here and then I'm going to reset. And then it puts me here, which is the start of the lap, so I can skip doing an out lap. Because I'm MLG hacker. Does my 5 camera work today? It does not. I wonder why that stopped working. It's a very useful feature. Okay, well... No, I guess this is just the height the mirror is supposed to, uh, the I'm supposed to be sat at. Okay, but... Well, <sighs> oh, 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 drifting. Okay, try to concentrate. But yeah, since I was going to try to do the four hours of Nürburgring by myself today, I was like, you know what? I'll set up the aircon. So I've done that. I've done it very terribly. Um, but I've done it. It's good enough to keep this tiny little room cool, so whatever. <sighs> oh dear, I needed to stop a lot for earlier than that. Okay, from my perspective, the music is too loud and I can't actually hear the car. But that may just be me. Anyone else opinions? Remember, if you're using the Frank Frankovay said compressor, you're banned from giving audio balance opinions. <laughs> no. Oh. It's not so much the engine I can't hear, it's the tyres. Like, I think they're screeching right now, but I can't hear anything. All I can hear is fucking music. Yeah, all I hear is music. I'm turning it down. <sighs> yeah, it's like... 
what, what I'm saying is, are you fine with music being turned down as well? Like, is that also okay? Uh, let's see. Uh, how do I get the good Windows audio thing? Volume mixer. You. 25%. Fuck you. Alright. See if I can actually hear the car now. Yes, I can. Excellent. It exits clear. There's GT freeze everywhere. Wait, why did I go back to the pits? What am I doing? Where's the guy? Did he die? Okay, whatever. Yeah, you no good flashing me, I'm fucking trying to get out of your fucking way. Good god. Maybe he's flashing me to say thanks or sorry or something, but... I tried. Do 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 Now, I remember by the end of the 24 hours, I was actually pretty confident at this race, but obviously I haven't done as much practice as I have for that. I've literally done, like, an hour. <laughs> so, I'm not as confident for this. Oh god, stop the car! Jesus. Oh, right, I should have done the reset thing. Oh, well, whatever, fuck it. Oh. Huh. So now... worry that I'm just not going to make the four hours by myself. But for the 24 hours, it was like I woke up and I drove the car for four hours by myself that one time, just spontaneously, didn't I? So. so I should try to get comfortable again, because I know I can do it. I have to slow down for that. Okay, you got to slow down for that. Cool. And of course, every time I reset, I get cold tires, which everybody is very quick to tell me, Josh, you have cold tires. And I tell you that, yes, I also need to drive on cold tires during the race, so fucking shut up. <laughs> right? Like, I know. <laughs> So don't do that. <laughs> but it is frustrating not being able to do laps, and I'm supposed to be able to do four hours. Fucking hell. Like, I was told that it takes more than one lap to warm up the tires. So it's like, okay, well I have to drive on cold tires for a substantial amount of time then. <laughs> uh, I forgot about this corner. Um, yeah, I don't know if I'm going to be able to do four hours without dying. Oh god, yeah, I don't remember. Like, I, I forget where I need to slow down, like here, for example. And that other corner that I was apparently supposed to slow down on. 
Like, I just don't have any natural feel for this car of like, oh, I'm going too fast into this corner, I know how much I need to slow down. Like, I just don't have anything. No, I fucking hate it, Eliko. <laughs> That's the other thing. The only car that I know how to use that is in this race is a car I fucking hate. <laughs> there are no cars that I don't fucking hate in this race. <laughs> this is the, the best one. <laughs> it's very frustrating. Jesus Christ. Ah, uh, fuck's sake. I fucking hate this car so much. <sighs> Pit exit's clear. I really don't give a shit about car brands in real life. It's like having a favourite really expensive watch brand, or having a favourite brand of yacht. It's just like, <laughs> can't afford any of these things anyway, <laughs> I don't give a shit. <laughs> Hello, Wayno. Oh no, I have accidentally gone the wrong way. Whoops, I should reset my car. Okay, can I even do like a lap, let alone a stint? I have never tried to play iRacing on a keyboard, no. <laughs> Can't imagine anything worse. <laughs> Okay, that wasn't even the car, that was just me being an idiot.
Okay. I lived the first section. Rare occurrence. Doing all right. Ah, oh, fucking murder cubs. Village one. Nice, nice. Thanks, Yowie. Hello. <laughs> Am I the only one you know by any chance? Okay, village two done. Then you got the shitty corner after it. Okay. Nova stuff. <laughs> okay. Right, it's the Titaner. Okay. <clears throat> Do you know him on a personal, spiritual, or fanboy level? <laughs> Joss or Max? Oh, fuck. Okay, up the hill. And then lift for this corner that the MX-5s don't have to lift for. Fucking damn it! Ah! Stupid, shitty fucking car. Okay. And I have to learn to live that corner at some point. Oh, easy, easy, easy. Oh, I've done the dupe. I've done the fucking stupid thing. I forgot that corner existed. Ah, <sighs> fuck. We'll need to pit for repairs. We've had the black and orange flag. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuck off. Two GT threes right behind me. Right, 
Remember this corner exists. Well done. Don't die. The track temperature's rising. It's now 38 Celsius. the other one left side right there Clear left. Jesus Christ okay fine I'm like the only non-GT3 in this session, aren't I? <laughs> I'm gonna get put in a weird split, I think. Purple. Even with going on the grass. Oh, there's another GT4 in front of me. Well, I'm never going to catch it, am I? Driving like an idiot. On your right. Right side's clear. Are you left serious? Side. Clear left. Jesus Christ. Well, you do stupid shit, you get stupid results. Fucking hell. I'm like in the braking zone. Like, what am I supposed to do? I want my foot flat to the brake, and if I lift it, I'll slam into the wall at the other end. And if I don't lift it and try to turn, I'll spin out. 
Like, there's nothing I can do. I'm a passenger at that point. It just shoves it up the inside and there isn't a card swift there. Good God. I hope that crap doesn't happen in the race. Fuck. Still haven't managed to do a single lap without dying. Bodes well for doing this for four hours. Fuck. Mm -hmm. Wrong side of the road. I was not where I thought I was. Don't be so on hard on myself, it's not an easy track. I'm planning to drive this for four hours in three hours time. <laughs> like, I'm not like just intentionally being an asshole to myself for no purpose. It's like, I'm gonna have to be flawless at this track in three hours. <laughs> so making any kind of mistake like that, that would just instantly end my race pretty bad. <laughs> I'm going to start the stream, it's going to say four hours of Nürburgring in the title, and then a bunch of people are going to be joined and be like, <laughs> yeah, right. Right, and then they're all going to be like, ugh, bet crash all, lol, ha ha ha, Josh is so shit, right? And then the race is going to start, and then on the first lap, I'm going to fucking drive into a wall, and then I'll get, they're all going to be like, wee, wee. And then the stream will end, right? That is not good, right? Cannot have that. So when I bin it into the wall and I get annoyed at myself, <laughs> it's for good reason. <laughs> Come on, GT3, you can do it. Car right, clear right. Would like to actually, you know, finish one of these fucking endurance races for once.
easy. Couldn't have been any slower through that. What I need is one of those fancy mixers that I can have my audio be different to the stream's audio, but... You know, that's a bit excessive. But yes, there is music. For some reason, it's really quiet for you and really loud for me, and I don't know why. It's very annoying. But I have to have it this quiet so I can actually hear the car and hear other cars and stuff like that. But then it's just like not audible on the stream. It's like I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Okay, I almost did a lap. The longest racetrack in the world, Bones. I can't wait for someone to actually me on that one. It is the Nurburgring Nordschleife VLN combined. Hello, Philip. How's practice going? Not super great. I'm dying quite a lot. And considering the race is in less than three hours, it's kind of concerning. Car right. Oh shit! Clear right. Ah oh, fuck. That was my bad. I wasn't even just daydreaming. Wasn't even looking. Didn't even know he was there. <laughs> didn't even know there was a car. <laughs> At least I didn't kill him. Uh, I keep forgetting I'm not in like a private practice session. And Jim doesn't tell me that there's faster cars behind and I don't get a blue flag because it's a practice session. Whoa, easy car. Good talk, Jim.
fuck. Oh. Goof that a little bit. I'm really surprised about the number of people that can't recognize a wind thingy. Like, have none of you played a golf video game ever? <laughs> but it's a surprisingly common question. So I guess I'm, like, just wrong that it's obvious what it is. Oh, there's a unit of measurement on it, okay. Hmm. I guess that is kind of weird, actually. Refuse to die on this fucking corner. Okay, good. Fuck. I try to take it in fifth all the time, Sventura, but I had to break for it, was the point. Shit, shit, okay. Yeah. But I, I, I didn't remember that I had to break for it, and I was, like, not breaking for it. And that was the problem. <laughs> that was the problem every single lap before this. Well, okay, maybe I was actually in sixth gear, but I was, like, actively slowing down. I just... The problem was I didn't know how much I needed to slow down, right? I might be. Yeah, I'm dead. <laughs> yeah, it's. I know. I memorize that corner because it's the corner that MX5s can do flat out, but this car can't because this car's shit. It's that corner. Ah. Uh, real life Nurburg 24 hours is next week. Oh, cool.
Yes, but then the car's cornering capabilities should be better to compensate for the fact that it is faster, Philip. I know it's because MX-5s are slower, but their cornering ability, like, relative to their speed, is a better than this car, which is what makes this car really shitty to drive. <laughs> it's like I'm driving a, like, big American muscle car or something. Like, all power, no brakes. Or no turn or whatever. It's like it's not it's not balanced as well as an MX-5 is. Anyway, another lap that I did not complete. Woohoo! Also, I hate first gear in this car and how it's totally useless. Basically driving a 5-speed instead of a 6-speed. Yeah, well, that's what I'm saying. But neither do I, because it's useless. <laughs> Oh, man. Okay, I'm starting to get the hang of doing this corner at, like, way lower speed. And then this one, yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah, I mean, I guess that is true. I just do use first gear too much. GT3 is coming. Slowing down too much there. Yeah, I guess the gearing on an LMP2 is really long because Le Mans, I suppose. On your right. Clear Fucking right. hell. Didn't give me much room, did he? Oh, cock. I forgot this corner existed. It's the, the corner that I forget exists, and I forgot it existed. Damn it. I lived.
What I'm happy about is that even without the aircon blowing directly on me, I'm still cool enough. Just about. Whoa, 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 whoa. The Titan ate me then. The fuck? Here's a question, is this new or old damage model? Old, okay. Yeah. Oh, GT3s don't have a new one. Oh, okay. Man, they're really slow at rolling that out. How long has new damage model been a thing? Like, several years, right? It's because they fuck it up every time. Right, okay. I hear the door going. That means Emma has ordered food. Will she move to actually answer it? That's the question. It's a GT3! I'm sure he'll be patient. Oh, I'm not letting you in. I'm just fucking up the corner. God damn it. Whatever, he got past perfectly fine, actually. Oh, dear. It's right, it's right, it's right. Don't panic. Oh, dear. I forgot to break for this corner. Oh, fuck it. Ah. <sighs> Uh, no, it's one of the. It's the day where Emma doesn't go to sleep. Um, she'll go to bed at some point today, and then I won't see her tomorrow, and then she'll be awake for two days again. Did I live that lap? I mean, I, I crashed a bit on the Titaner, but I didn't have to reset, did I? Did I do a lap? Oh my god, I did a lap. Your quickest overall.
Nice apex, idiot. <laughs> Someone's got straight on there. Was it me? <laughs> I don't remember. That might be my tracks from ages ago. Hey look, I remembered this corner existed. Oh, I fuck up this one though. Apex. That was a TCR back there. Hello, Ormit. Ah, uh, I didn't slow down for the fucking Titaner again. Ugh. Twice I've slapped the side of the car, I should probably reset the car. Ah, fucking Titaner, man. The truck temperature is increasing. It's now 41 Celsius. That's good. Good, good stat, Jim. Whoa, 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 whoa. Nobody say it.
There. Problem solved. Yeah. I mean... It's not that crazy, right? Like, if it's like the track surface in the sunlight and stuff. Yeah. I mean, eye racing is weird with track surfaces, it is true. Time. Ah. <sighs> uh. <sighs> oh my God! I'm only eighteen seconds off of the pace. Jesus Christ. <sighs> Wasn't that spa, Centaur? You were there. Oh, cool. <sighs> Imagine living close enough to a racetrack to go visit it and having the means of transportation to get there. It's like I could go to Fruxton a fair amount, but I don't. There is no way for me to get there. Ah. <sighs> <sighs> well, I think with this, all they could do is, like, restrict entry to the GP area, right? Like, they can't... They're not going to be able to guard miles and miles of countryside, are they? So I think with the Nürburgring, you could probably still go, despite the restrictions. Oh. <sighs> Has it, Zventor? Like, even all of the, like, all of this. Like, the, the Grand Prix stuff I could... I could imagine, but not, like, all of this. Uh, I mean, if you only have the track and nothing else, Wipok, yeah, but... If you're like with your friends and you have like a radio to listen to commentary, commentary or something, or hell, like some kind of video, but I don't know how you'd have internet or anything. Um, or maybe you had like satellite TV or something. I don't know. Then yeah, it's fine. But yeah, just sitting here like on your own watching a car go vroom every like minute or so is probably not that great. The 
24 hour race is quite the experience outside of the race so much to Thank see. Thank you. Like, like what? Like, what What do you do, Centaur? Because I've always been interested in going or whatever, but... Okay. Interesting. Oh. Oh. <laughs> yeah, but like, where are you, Sventor? You're like, you're not in the. You're just in the countryside, or you at the, at here. Yeah, but like, where? There's a lot of tracks, Ventor. <laughs> like, you're not in the Grand Prix bit. You're like, in the countryside, like here. In the countryside, yeah. Okay. Hmm. <sighs> uh. Yeah, I mean, you need a car, right, to be able to drive around all these little side roads. And I'm sure it would take, like, it would probably take, like, half an hour to an hour to go from, like, here to the Grand Prix circuit, right? Massive traffic jams, yeah. <laughs> That's funny. Traffic jams. Yeah, I would I would love to go to to watch one of these. Just like couch surf viewers. <laughs> an hour away. Oh, man. Damn COVID stuff. Like, that's actually possible to do, then, Sventor, if you would, like, be willing to have a bunch of people <laughs> like, stay at your place. And if you have, like, a car the, and the shit. The leader's just done a 8.44.5 seconds. And, like, we have just a few of us go. Maybe like me and some Germans. <laughs> we just like pay for petrol and shit. Well, yeah, I mean, 
sure, like, can't this year for other reasons as well. Like, I cannot get into Germany. <laughs> oh, 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 little touch. Ah. Uh. <laughs> so suddenly all the Germans are like, oh, I live right next to this track. <laughs> oh, jeez. Sorry. Yeah, I'm fucking serious. Like, why not, right? Like, it's not going to cost that much. Like, like from your perspective, uh, I mean, it'd be like, you would have to be like a tour guide or whatever. So you'd be like, oh, here's where we get food and, and I'll drive these places and stuff. But as long as, like, we're willing to, like, pay for the things, right? Like, the petrol required to drive to places, the food that we eat, you know. <clears throat> like, I've had people come to my place before, just like somewhat randomly. Yeah, okay, 24 hours, interesting. 50 euros, huh? For the whole 24 hours, Christ. I, I, I'm I, guessing that's not like a grandstand or anything, right? Oh! You can sit anywhere on the GP track and the Nordschleife. It's very fair pricing. Huh. Interesting. Yeah, that is pretty good. So, like, since you've been before Sventor, do you have, like, I'm assuming you don't get a data connection, but is there, like, a radio broadcast of the rate, like, commentary or something? It's on YouTube. Yeah, but... I said, like, you probably don't have data. I haven't been since 2018, but in last years they had, like, massive 4G antennas there to improve internet. Oh, okay. Huh. Just for the event, what the fuck? <laughs> oh, right, okay, interesting. Because that was my that was my understanding of like racetracks is that they're in the middle of nowhere, and there's like loads of people there, and like the crappy like spread out countryside internet can't like the radio antennas for the phones can't handle it. You can't call or text anyone. You can't use the internet because it's just swamped. It's only designed for like you know the five people that live in a village <laughs> down the road. Yeah, I was like that in the noughties, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh man, they literally just roll up 4G trucks, what the fuck. 
It's the twenties, Josh. Yeah, yeah, of course. <laughs> Come on, Josh, it's the twenties. We have the technology. <laughs> Oh dear. Alright, so you would just like... I mean, I don't know what my data would be like, because... You had like... The, when I used to go to ESA, you had the the, e, you had the the EU stuff. So it was like, I would get a text message from my, my phone provider, and they'd be like, Oh, because of the EU laws, we're not allowed to fucking destroy your phone bill. You can use all of your data and stuff normally as if you were in the UK. Fuck you, right? I'd get that text message. But now I don't know if I would get that. So yeah, I'd have to get like a prepaid data sim. And my, my phone does have two sim slots, so that wouldn't be a problem. But I'd have to watch out for that. Make sure to not use data on my actual phone. Because I know they were chomping at the bits to be able to start destroying people's phone bills abroad again. Oh, are they still doing it, Orbit? Okay, that's good. Yeah, okay, well, maybe there'd be hotspot. I, I don't know. I'm just trying to think about any, like, potential issues here. Yeah, exactly, Orbit. Yeah, I, I know they really want to stop doing it. Uh, well, anyway, it's not like we could do anything anytime soon. This would have to definitely be, like, next year for sure. But... No, you go ahead. <laughs> no, you go ahead. No, please, please, after you. <gasps> okay. The pit exit looks clear. But, you know, it's like, where's the closest airport and can I find flights or whatever? I wonder if Emma would want to go. And I wonder who else we could get to go. Like, I, I don't know how many people you'd be able to accommodate, Cementor. Or if you're even willing. I don't want to mean to, like, force this on you, but I'm just like, yo! <laughs> Streamer man requests. <laughs> I could bring a laptop and I could play SA by the roadside. How about that? <laughs> There's. <laughs> There's a deal. <laughs> oh, I didn't slow down. Oh, I died. Whatever, I'll just keep going. I'll just, um... Uh, get over that side of the road and then reset. <sighs> yeah, they're doing the same thing. <laughs> yeah, give it as a Bottomus stream and not a Joshua stream, yeah. Only Bottomus viewers get to hear about this. But yeah, we, we could organise something. All the Germans could come. Yeah, like Oromit said. Phil, all right. 
<sighs> but we, we definitely have to like organize it next year like hopefully things are actually possible to do next year I remember last year when everyone was just like, oh, we'll have to do it next year, or we'll be fine by next year, right? And stuff like that. And I was just like, mm, nah, this is going to take two years. Uh, I hope I'm not wrong about everything taking two years. Fuck. I'm the wrong gear. Yeah, hopefully you'll remember it. Oh, I can have schnitzels again. I remember that. The last time I did a road trip with Trollbear. Going to ESA. And we drove, like, through the... Hello? Okay. We drove down the autobahn or whatever. Schnitzels are like the little flat chicken breaded things, right? They're like massive chicken nuggets, but different for some reason. Fucking loved those things. Yeah, those things were great. Oh, okay, I died Jack, again. A faster car approaching. No, All right. Track limits. They'll invalidate this lap. Did I try curry worst? No. I mean, I was only ever like, I was only ever in Germany like to travel through it. I've never like stayed in it. I went to a nice German McDonald's that was more like a cafe than a McDonald's that f like weirded me out. It was like I was at a proper, proper restaurant cafe sort of thing. There were like, you know, fountains and stuff. And there was like a big tray, like, you know, big glass area with a bunch of cakes and stuff in it. And I was like, this isn't a McDonald's. <laughs> And then, like, that was for breakfast. And then later in the day, we had... We stopped at, like, a ro uh, at, like a motorway side place to have schnitzels. Oh, God, I didn't slow down. Oh, fuck it. I'm too busy thinking about Germany. <laughs> An actual overtake in Extreme E. What the fuck? I'm missing o extreme E overtake scale. Holy shit. <clears throat> there. Huh. <sighs> Yeah, hopefully, hopefully by next year, we'll have to like, Ooh. like if we're all gonna like make the effort to do this, it should probably be for the 24 hours of NURB instead of just like a VLN. But I'm sure we can organize around that. And I'm sure there'd be like more stuff for the 24 hours anyway, right? Like, sure, it only costs it costs 50 euros a price ticket, but like. Fucking hell. Like, for me to go watch a Formula One race at Silverstone, it'd be like 300 pounds. <laughs> like, 50 euros for a 24 hour event? Sure. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh. Last time I checked, Gail, yeah. Yeah, it's fucking crazy. Like, I think you can get, like, a Friday, no frills, minimum everything ticket for, like, 50. <laughs> French Grand Prix is, like, 150. Well, I mean, who wants to watch the French Grand Prix? I mean, you know. <laughs> but, yeah, I mean, Silverstone just is, like, a big thing in the UK, right? So... They probably gonna they probably still sell out even with ridiculous prices. Huh. 
<laughs> oh, okay. I'm not gonna eat spicy things, guys. It's not happening. I don't like spicy food, and it's really bad for my insides. <laughs> so, no. <laughs> not, not eating spicy stuff. <laughs> oh, cool, Phil. I mean, that's a pretty good place to do it, right? Were you in like, the, if you're in, like the grandstands or something, you see quite a lot. The corner behind the Mercedes Tower, yeah, yeah. It's like back there, right? When's renting an apartment in Monaco for the GP? <laughs> yeah, before the hairpin, yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, Zandvoort GP, yeah. <sighs> Yeah, how many people would we need, Philip? Like, 20? 20 people for a two-room apartment, right? We'll chip in a thousand pounds. <laughs> and we get, like, one set of keys. Well, yeah, but no one's going to rent an apartment for us for just a month, right? <laughs> yeah, I know, two room, not two bedroom. I know, I know. I know what you said. <laughs> and I said, 20 people. <laughs> I, I know what I said. <laughs> You have like, you have like, me and Emma could sleep in the bathtub, <laughs> like either ends. <laughs> Rooftop pool thingies at Singapore. Yeah, I don't know about that. You assume bathroom is big enough for the bathtub. Oh yeah, I do actually. Yeah, you're right. Well, I can I can sleep on top of the toilet. Whatever. <laughs> ah. Anyway, it's less than two hours until the race. I should probably actually practice more. Pit exit's clear. Stay behind the white line. Soshi19 subscribed to Botimus. That doesn't make any sounds. Thanks, Soshi. Hello. Yeah, races in two hours, right? Or is it one hour and... Or three hours? It have time zone shenanigans happened? Hang on, I will double check when the race actually starts. Let me just get to the thingy.
the race is in one hour and 40 minutes. Yep, that's correct. That was right. When I said two hours, obviously. You know, one hour 40. Alright, let's actually concentrate and do some laps for a bit. Nice corner, idiot. Oh my god. Do you know that, that red and white thing, Josh? You're supposed to hit those? Near the curb again. <laughs> oh. I forgot to break for this corner. All right, Josh, we need to watch the track limits. You'll need to slow down if you don't want a penalty. Qualifying is going to be fun. And I wonder what split I'm going to get in. Probably be quicker for you to order a physical copy, right, Zephyr? Like, pretty sure physical copies exist, don't they? Or are they only for certain parts of the world, actually? then you just don't update, right? <laughs> well, I guess if you're forced to do it. Kind of defeats the purpose of them having a physical copy if you have to then update it, right?
But I guess this is Microsoft. I've got a product for people who don't have an internet connection. It's called the Xbox 360 Soft, right? What did I say? Microsoft? Oh, okay, I fucked up the quote, whatever. I meant to say micro quote soft, but hey ho, whatever. I'm reading chat, I'm not paying attention. Might just stop, to be honest, have an hour break, and then start streaming on Joshimus half an hour before. <sighs> yes, it is, Soshi. Ah. My nose. Sorry, I'm just cropping my chat a bit. This has been wrong for ages and it's been really annoying me. Okay, there we go. That's better. Oh, there we go. Chat is so much bigger now, holy shit. Okay, well anyway. Um, yeah, I'm gonna stop streaming. Uh, I will return on Joshimus in like an hour's time. But I should probably take a break before I actually do the thing instead of sitting around in this chair. So, yeah. Alright. See you later. Back in an hour. Bye.